hey 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 family it's your girl Serena Elizabeth and welcome back to the channel you guys so in real time today is going to be a same day posting so today is September 19th it's Thursday and I wanted to come on here really quickly because I just wanted to chit chat with you guys so if you guys um, have seen on my community tab I went ahead and posted some pictures that finally surfaced of Janae's photo shoot with Ralph Lauren I'm so excited they came out so good so um just a quick story janae had been requested for ralph lauren a few years ago she was a baby this was probably not a baby but she was a toddler and this was actually pre uh pandemic and so that did not work out at that time but you know like big campaigns like this is always you know a dream for at least us moms because we know or us parents because we know the significance of the brands the kids they don't know like janae still doesn't quite understand what she does like she sees pictures of herself and she's like oh that's so cute oh that came out cute but she doesn't like understand what she's really doing she likes the idea of going and meeting friends the whole experience of being pampered and getting her makeup and hair done and you know taking pictures but like she doesn't really understand now that she's getting older she's like oh okay well people are seeing these pictures right like where are we like when are we going to see these pictures so she's starting to get it now but like prior to she really didn't understand and she doesn't know what ralph lauren is she doesn't know how significant and iconic it is you know to be a part of this brand and be you know like a face of this brand so she doesn't really realize how big it is but for me i was like oh my god this is like a dream another dream job was gap because how iconic is gap and you know it's like a household name or a household brand it's affordable it's very stylish it's great quality so like american culture you you know you are shopping you know gap and so when she got gap and that was always something that i wanted because even my son was also this Milan hacking in the back my son who was also a child model prior to when before he was even born um i had saw a picture of this little boy in a pea coat and a hat from gap i kept the picture because I, I was like this little boy i bet you sincere comes out looking like him and you know when you're pregnant you don't know what your kid is going to look like you're just like trying to imagine but i saw this kid and i was like I bet you Sincere is going to come out looking something like him. So I bought that pea coat and I bought that hat and I kept that picture. And sure enough, Sincere did come out looking, you know, pretty close to what this boy looked like. And I wasn't trying to will that or anything like that. But I was just trying to imagine what my first child would look like. And it kind of came true. It inspired me to buy that pea coat and hat. And, um, you know, every time I think about the gap, I think about that story. So... The Gap was like a huge thing for us to be able to do. And I was so proud when Janae was able to do it. And anytime, you know, they even request her or consider her or hold her, um, I am like just excited because they're seeing her and, you know, they acknowledge her. So um, when we got booked for this, I was just like, <laughs> what? So extremely excited for her and happy to be a part of the experience and for her to get so many looks and to, you know, see the set that we see in all these huge fashion magazines and you know, if you ever shop in a Ralph Lauren store or if you go to the big department stores that have like ads like in the store and big pictures and things like that to see like what they do in order just to get a shot just to style a shot you know so that people will like have these like images ingrained in their brain of how iconic and how american you know this is so i'm a proud mama right now so i'm just gushing y'all so forgive me pardon me but <laughs> i'm just so proud of baby girl 
So yeah, it was a great experience to be a part of. I'm sure there's gonna be other pictures surfacing. She had about five or six different looks. So um, she shot with multiple kids. Um, so I'm sure there's gonna definitely be stuff still coming out. So still be on the lookout. We might finally see some stuff in stores, but if you're on their mailing list, you'll definitely get you know the emails of when you see Janae and if you see her, let me know. Um, but yeah, I'm definitely on those mailing lists. But with all that said, you guys, um, what I wanted to do, we have put together, and it's unfinished. It's not, well, I don't wanna say it's unfinished. It's just not as many looks as I was gonna do for you guys. But I wanna show you guys what we did. We put together a little mini lookbook for your girls for back to school fashion this is going to be showcasing Shein looks because I do like Shein for her they're stylish some stores are going to give you better quality um, items than others so you know just try and be mindful of the stores that you're buying from I don't know all of the ones but like the ones that I have received that are of better quality, I will go in my Shein app and like, you know, um, find those stores and I'll go ahead and link them in the description box. And as a matter of fact, of all of the outfits that I show you guys, I will go ahead and link them in the description box so that you can shop for your girls as well. But make sure if you haven't already, go ahead, subscribe, make sure you drop a comment for me in the box below. Send your congratulations and all that good stuff to Janae. She likes to read these comments. I showed her the community tab as well. Yeah, so let's go ahead and get into this mini little fashion show lookbook for you guys. I hope you enjoy and I'll see you in the next one. me 